This is Mary at the Mary Atelier, and I am going to be working on my week one borders. I'm doing border number two. I'm working off of the Chrysler building, which was done in the Art Deco style. Now, the first border I did off of the tower. The second border I am actually taking off of a lower level of the building. So, I am going to zoom in a little here so that you can see this just a little bit better. My camera is up and working again. I am so happy about that. So, it is, it almost looks like a fence post line, but it is very much an Art Deco style. I drew in the bottom line there, which is really the lower white that you see off of my camera. And uh, then I'm just gonna draw in all these little squares down at the bottom of the motif. And there's one big square and then two smaller horizontal squares. And I just do that clear across the border. I did use the third border down because it's a little bit wider. And there I made a mistake, but that's okay. If this is just a doodle. Remember, this is a doodle. So I'm not using a ruler to make these really um, pristine. This is just all freehand drawing. And now I'm drawing in the little posts there. I call them little posts. I start out with the lower triangle, and then I stack two on top of it. Now I'm just drawing the lower triangle triangles clear across the page sort of remember this is a doodle now I'm stacking little triangles on top of it they almost look like little trees or fence post just depending on how you want to draw them how carefully you want to draw them I'm happy with how this turned out in the long run and then I put those two smaller triangles in between each one. If you could see that picture close up, you could see that there are little cement blocks in between each one of them. And then I'm putting in the top rolls up at the top. Very happy with this. It, it is very much an art deco and very geometric. I'm using the Super Tip Crayolas. Uh, Dee Dee Willingham inspired me to pick up a package of these. I am using a blue, and no, I'm not coloring the Chrysler Building blue. I'm just reminding you, this is a border page that's inspired by the Chrysler Building. And I think that blue just kind of makes it pop out a little bit more on the page. So I'm just coloring all my little motif elements in blue. And then I get out the uh, lightest gray color and put some grays around there so this whole motif this whole border will be done in blue and gray I could see this as a border around uh, a room that is done in a light slate blue gray which I think is what Linda did her room in a slate blue painted her her walls of slate blue. Now I got out a darker gray and I'm pushing those motifs into the background. And I could see uh, a little segment of each one of these being done as a doodle on your page in different areas. So there it is, it's done. I'm very happy with it. Very, very happy with it. And now I'm just documenting Art Deco Chrysler Building, and I'm just calling it border number two building motifs. And then you'll see that I put week one and week two at the top. So that I hope that you've enjoyed this, and I hope you have a great day.